Australia, a land of stunning beauty, unique wildlife, and an unparalleled reputation for danger. From venomous snakes and lethal jellyfish to ferocious crocodiles and formidable sharks, this continent is home to some of the deadliest creatures on Earth. But what if we told you that today's Australia is a tamer version of its prehistoric past? Join us as we embark on a comprehensive journey to uncover the secrets of the deadliest creatures of prehistoric Australia. Modern Australia is infamous for its dangerous wildlife. With 20 of the 25 most venomous snakes in the world, the saltwater crocodile, the largest living reptile, and the deadly box jellyfish, Australia's reputation for peril is well-deserved. But this is only the tip of the iceberg. To truly understand Australia's dangerous reputation, we must travel back in time. Prehistoric Australia was a land of giants and deadly predators where survival was a daily battle. From colossal reptiles to fearsome marsupials, this ancient land was one of the most perilous places on Earth. Our journey begins with the giant serpent, Wanambi. Living alongside the formidable Megalania and Quincana, Wanambi was one of the largest snakes of its time. Unlike today's venomous snakes, Wanambi used its sheer size and strength to overpower its prey. Growing up to 20 feet long, it would ambush unsuspecting animals, constricting them with powerful coils until they could no longer breathe. Next, we meet the Quincana, a land-dwelling crocodile unlike any we've seen today. During the Pleistocene epoch, Quincana roamed the land with long legs that allowed it to chase down prey. With a length of up to 20 feet and a powerful bite capable of slicing through flesh, Quincana was a top predator in ancient Australia. The Megalania, or Varanus priscus, was the largest terrestrial lizard ever to exist. This apex predator could grow up to 26 feet long and weigh as much as two tons. With razor-sharp teeth, powerful limbs, and possibly even venom, Megalania was a formidable hunter. It preyed on large animals, including early humans, using ambush tactics similar to its modern relative, the Komodo dragon. Not all predators in prehistoric Australia were reptiles. Thylacolio, also known as the marsupial lion, was a fearsome carnivorous marsupial. Despite its name, Thylacolio was more closely related to koalas and wombats than to modern lions. It possessed the strongest bite force of any known mammal, pound for pound, and had retractable claws for climbing and killing. This made Thylacolio a highly efficient predator. Even the herbivores of prehistoric Australia were formidable. The Diprotodon, the largest marsupial to ever live, was essentially a giant wombat weighing up to 3.85 tons. Its massive size and strong bite force made it a difficult target for predators, proving that even the plant eaters of ancient Australia were no pushovers. Australia's prehistoric landscape was also home to giant flightless birds like the Genyornis, which stood over six feet tall and weighed around 500 pounds. These thunderbirds were equipped with powerful legs and sharp claws, making them a significant threat to any predator or human that dared to challenge them. Australia's prehistoric dangers were not limited to the land. The surrounding oceans were teeming with monstrous marine predators. From giant sharks like the Megalodon to massive marine reptiles, these waters were as deadly as the land. These ancient oceans were hunting grounds for some of the most fearsome creatures to ever exist. But what led to the extinction of these incredible creatures? Climate change, human activity, and competition for resources all played a role in the decline of Australia's megafauna. As the climate became more arid and humans began to hunt and alter the landscape, many of these ancient giants could not adapt and eventually disappeared. While many of these prehistoric predators are now extinct, their legacy lives on in the descendants that still roam Australia today. Modern reptiles, marsupials, and birds all carry traces of their ancient ancestors. The evolution of these species is a testament to the resilience and adaptability of life in one of the most challenging environments on Earth. Today, Australia is still a land of extraordinary biodiversity. From the lush rainforests of Queensland to the arid deserts of the outback, this continent supports an incredible array of life. The unique evolutionary history of Australia has resulted in an unparalleled diversity of species, each adapted to thrive in its specific environment. With such a rich natural heritage, conservation is crucial to preserving Australia's unique wildlife for future generations. Protecting habitats, combating invasive species, and addressing the impacts of climate change are all vital efforts to ensure the survival of Australia's remarkable fauna. As we look to the future, 
The story of Australia's deadliest creatures serves as a reminder of the delicate balance of nature. By understanding the past and protecting the present, we can help shape a future where Australia's unique wildlife continues to thrive. Thank you for joining us on this comprehensive journey through the deadly history of prehistoric Australia. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more incredible stories from the natural world.